You know, when we were at CinemaCon all the way back in April, I think it was, they, we saw previews and footage and scenes from a lot of different projects. One of the ones that made me scratch my head a lot was one for an upcoming Christmas-themed movie, Violent Night, with David Harbour as a very violent Santa Claus. Now, here's the thing. We have seen a number of movies that have already done this shtick. Like, who was the professional wrestler? Um, the, the big undefeated professional wrestler, bald head. Uh, Goldberg? Black Goldberg, yeah, Goldberg did a, a an evil Santa movie. There was another <laughs> one that was like an evil Santa movie or something like it, it, it's been done. So they showed us a preview for it at CinemaCon, and I'm I I never didn't really know what to think about it. This seems to me like a really stupid idea. <laughs> I love David Harbour. Like you even that awful Hellboy movie, I thought he was pretty he was good. good in it. I yeah. like him a lot. But I will admit watching the trailer there are moments in this trailer you know what it looks like it looks like a saturday night live fake commercial trailer it totally did when you watch a trailer put your mindset in this thing is i'm watching saturday night live and this is one of the fake commercials that's what it looks like but that said there were glimpses and moments in this trailer and it makes that, me want to see it now <laughs> that made me go that made me go maybe because what do we say about what do i say about comedy all the time if you make me laugh Everything else is fine. It yeah. doesn't matter if you do everything else wrong, if you make me laugh. And, and I will admit, this trailer, I had a few guffaws watching this trailer. I did too. So I know, Rob, you had a chance to see the trailer for Violent Night. What do you think? I'm with you, man. I, I, I laughed a few times. I mean, I, there's, a, there's a novel called Santa Steps Out by Robert Devereaux that I, it's hard R, very different, that I've wanted to see made. But I don't see any, I never saw a clear path to getting that movie made. But this... R-rated Santa, hyper violent. I'm in, man. I, 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 I look. I chuckled. Who doesn't like this kind of a thing? I, I think it could be great. And I like the clever. Like he pulls out the computer display. Oh, you're, you're nice. You're on the nice. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I liked all that. All these guys are on my naughty list. Yeah, that's the part that I went. This is totally Saturday Night Live. But still, there was some funny parts in there. What did you think about it, Chris? I love this actually. <laughs> This is, this is ridiculous. I am, I'm also just a total sucker for David Harbour. I'll see anything he does. I would watch him read the Yellow Pages. I think he's wonderful. And I love that this is just gritty Santa diehard. I'm so excited about it. And John Leguizamo. I will see anything with John Leguizamo as well. With him as the baddie in this, really? I'm really excited. Even Spawn again? Did I, you sit down and watch Spawn again? Spawn is honestly a guilty pleasure of mine. <laughs> it's so bad, but I love watching that movie. I'll like, even watch even Super his, Mario Brothers. Like I love him. Even his like his coat, it's leather, so it's a little more like tough guy. It's not notice that it's not like a wool right. or something yeah. like that. So is this a Christmas movie, John? I you know what? I didn't even notice when the uh, release date is. December second. Okay, but, but this is date. clearly it everything revolves. Everything is about a central iconic figure of Christmas. This is not Die Hard. This is a Christmas movie. Whereas Die Hard is not. But yes, anyway. Is. Question is for you guys. What did you think of the Violent Night trailer? I got, I'm a little bit on the fence. I, I did not have positive thoughts about this movie, but I, I will admit this trailer, it did make me laugh. And if the movie can make me laugh the way the trailer did, then I'll be all for it. And I love David Harbour. How do you guys feel about it? Jump down to the comment section below and leave your thoughts there. Guys, we want to take a second to thank the sponsor of this video, me undies. Now guys, I admit for all my life, I have been a low quality underwear wearing kind of guy. I always just got the cheapest pack of underwear I could find because I never really thought about it. Well, that all changed when I started wearing me undies. They are simply the softest and most comfortable underwear I have ever owned and I will never go back. And guys, spooky season is here. And so is the latest Halloween collection by me undies. Warning though, it's scary soft. Me undies is back with a new limited edition prints like Jack Attack, No Body Like You, and Spell It Out. So go on and grab undies, socks, bralettes, and more made from their feels like you have nothing on micromodal fabric. And if you need a last minute costume, be lazy and transform into a spooky skeleton with their loungewear set, Lazy Bones. Guys, the scary soft hype is real. If you're not impressed with me undies, your first pair is on us. That's a promise. To get 20% off your first order and free standard shipping on US orders, go to meundies.com slash campia. That's meundies.com slash campia.